Welcome, everyone. It is Wednesday night. It is 8 o'clock. It is time for another episode of Barbershop Royale. Barbershop. I hope not just are... any episode, Steve. Barbershop. Oh, not just episode. Episode 4, Royale. our very first live challenge mm -hmm. i'll tell you mm -hmm. what all of our previous ones have been pre-recorded uh stuff that i assembled ahead of time this one is going to be live it hopefully will be completely unnoticeable to you all in the audience the difference it's also possible it will be a gigantic train wreck we will find <laughs> out i have no idea we don't even know either it way could. anything could happen either way i'll tell you what at this point it doesn't even matter because we have made it you know how i know because there is a Wikipedia page about us. No. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's when you when you have entered an encyclopedia that anybody can edit. That's how you know you're big time. <laughs> well, I know, right? Especially when we're not the ones who put it in ourselves. Yeah, I know, really. That's very true. <laughs> <laughs> so we are going to yeah. have a great time tonight. In fact, the challenge has already started. But before we tell you about that, Todd, you got to tell us. Yeah, about let's that let's talk about. Let's talk about last week's episode. So last week's episode, if you haven't caught up, by the way, check us out on our YouTube channel, uh, which now is named uh, youtube.com slash C slash Destination Quartet. Thanks for Thanks to all of you. Writers, everybody. Uh, we, we, yeah. got, we got to name it. Um, but uh, if you haven't caught, it, caught up on this, the first episode was welcome videos and got to see all the quartets sing. Second one was an egg and spoon relay race. And then the third one, which was last the last episode two weeks ago, was called Keep It at Barbershop. The quartets were challenged to do their version of, of keeping things as close to pure barbershop as their perception uh, uh, would would force them to do. So a pretty wide variety of songs, but every one of them absolutely beautiful. And what a great showcase, not only of the incredible talent and, and you know, not just the comedic talents that we've seen out of these groups and likely we'll see again tonight, but the singing talent for all of them and their ability to put together beautiful songs, in some cases, some really heartwarming videos uh, was really nice to see. The results of that, of course, were that there was a winner of that episode, and there was a quartet that was eliminated. We announced the winner uh, of the episode a week ago, uh, but we'll re-announce it here. The winner of the episode was C'est La Vie. Nope. That's, no. no. The winner of that episode was Ripple Effect. Ripple Effect. Yeah. Yeah. Ripple effect. We are yeah. already off and, to a great uh, start. <laughs> yeah. And Ripple Effect had a, had a really cool video. Uh, check it out on their Facebook page of them sure. uh, seeing the results. Sure. That is a lot of fun for us to watch. Uh, but in the meantime, Steve, I think we have a montage of how that episode we went. We do. If you missed it, here's what you missed. You should go back and watch. Thank you. 
So that pretty much sums up how the episode went. And I got to tell you, it was a really close vote, guys. In fact, the bottom two quartets, which were C'est La Vie and Hot Second, were only separated by less than four ballots. Less than four. I mean, we've never had a finish that close before. Unfortunately, that does mean that one of them has to be eliminated. And so I'm sad to say that the quartet that we're saying goodbye to this week is Hot Second. What? Really? What? We volunteer as tribute. Huh? W what do you mean? You, you all just barely beat them. Hot Second is amazing, and we really hate to see them go. They definitely deserve a second chance, and right now, our lives are pretty hectic. All right, well then, C'est La Vie changes their four votes to Hot Second. Does that mean we're in last place now? I mean, I, I guess so. Are, are you sure? Absolutely. Yes, yes, yes. of yes. course. Thanks again to Destination Quartet for having us on your show. We had such a great time and really enjoyed meeting all the other quartets and doing all these fun activities. We're sad to be leaving, but um, we have a lot of things going on in our life right now. So we're excited to give Hot Second a, another chance. So good luck, everybody. Hope you have fun, and we'll see you next time. Well, all right then. Um, bye, C'est La Vie. We loved having you. Uh, you've been great. And I guess, well, that means that Hot Second is still competing this week. Are all four of you okay with that? Yeah! <laughs> well, then, you better start looking for items. Go to it. Hello? Yeah, really nice. <laughs> okay, well, uh, they better get moving. All right, speaking of Hot which, Second's got a little bit of a slow start. They're already they're moving, off. guys. Let's speaking of honest. which, Sam, you want to tell the audience what it is that they're doing here? I would love to. I, I identify much more with this one than even with the other physical activity of the egg race, just because this one's, I know some of the things they're trying to find because I came up with them. Not only with students, but at late hours when I'm brainstorming things for them to find. <laughs> All these quartets are currently, as of right now, scurrying about either homes or out in the wilderness or out on the roads, out of shops, trying to find a list of 200 items. There's no way that they're going to find all 200. So to make sure that we give them a little incentive for a few of them, we've given them point values from one to five. What was the max score they could possibly get, Steve? Uh, 467. 467. That's if so, they find all 200 <laughs> items. If you find all 200 items. <laughs> now, most of them will be satisfied with just a selfie picture taken with the item or the, shall we say, like emotion I think some of them have. So they can take a selfie with that. Or even more preferably, they post a small three to five second video. So over the course of the evening, they'll be sending those via Twitter to our handle of hashtag BRTheGreatHunt. So we'll be having them go off to that Twitter account that we are watching. We have several people that are actually helping us out with keeping track of the different uh, pictures that are sent in, checking them off. And then eventually we'll be having a leaderboard that pops up on our screen that shows the top three quartets. Well... Speaking of these quartets, we are going to be checking in with them throughout the night as well. We're going to have them call into the show. We already have uh, one here. We've got Robert from Ripple Effect. Here he is. Robert, hey, how's hey, Ripple man. Effect doing so far? What's up, man? Uh, I think we're doing really well. I'm just sporting our charity's face mask here, Sing Canada Harmony. Ready nice. nice. Very nice. nice. How are you guys? We're great. We're good. We can't okay. wait to see what you guys find. What uh what well, so what's your all strategy? How are you guys going about it? Well, Aaron's doing stuff at home because we've got baby Lila that she's gotta take care right. of. Uh good and thinking. then 
Rachel is going to be driving around the country because uh, she lives in the country. Well, <laughs> I'm getting off camera here. How do I do that? Um, and then uh, I'm starting at home and then I'm going to hit the car. And I've just found the board game. I have Golden Girls Clue. Oh, my God. <laughs> Whoa. Nice. Whoa. Nice. Can that be worth wow. the next point, please? <laughs> oh, thank, you for, thank you for being a friend. Oh. <laughs> We're going to go travel down the road and back again. It's back again. Yes. <laughs> all right, man. We don't want to take up all your time to go find items. Good luck. Keep going. Thank you. See you later. See you later. <laughs> this is wild. Sing Harmony Canada. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Golden Girls so, Clue. It has been. Can we, can we, I want to play it. Like, like, when we go to visit it. Ontario, we're playing that. Yeah. <laughs> we'll tell you what. We are 10 minutes into this uh this thing already let's check out the leaderboard let's see who our top three are yeah Ooh, yeah let's do it go let's hopefully this works it did there whoa we go. trademark trademark in Holy the lead cow. with 41 full of it 33 ripple effect 25 all right mm. well we are not solid the start below that that is a solid start in 12 minutes that's a lot of points real fast it hopefully is. They will so that's uh, that. with the point waiting, not just number of pictures and videos sent in. That's with the five points for the most difficult, right? Yeah, yeah. So some of the items, you know, are worth more points, obviously, because, you know, <laughs> if, if just a picture of a pine cone is not worth quite as much as finding a, what was it? Finding a little kid to sing, harmonizing with a little kid you don't know, singing Mary Had a something Little like Lamb that. or something. Yeah. Yeah. Right, right. <laughs> that's one of them. Yeah, I don't remember exactly. Well, socially distanced. Uh, you know, while we're here at this point, is this a good time to, to thank our, our behind the scenes helpers? Yes, it, it would be a great time. So, so behind the scenes, we have three incredible volunteers that uh, are often in the chat. So you're not seeing them chatting because they're hard at work. Uh, for the show. They're actually taking the hashtags that are coming in on Twitter uh, with all of the entries and figuring out where they go on the spreadsheet of the incredible list of items that they're trying to find and creating the tally for us all to watch. And those those volunteers are, in no particular order, Xander Williams, Linda Noble, and Victoria White uh, from... Okay. Connecticut, Massachusetts, uh, uh, friends of ours, and, and we're so thankful for their time. We'll, we'll thank them a couple of times tonight. All right, so tell you what, let us head over to Twitter and take a look at some of these entries. Let's see sure. what they found. So far, we have Rachel from Ripple Not Effect. Made with old wood, number 21. <laughs> made with old wood, number 21. I don't know what that little thing is, but it's made of wood, which was apparently wood. Yeah, I can't tell. <laughs> Let's see, what else do we have? We have uh, Full of It, all spelling out YMCA. Nice. Uh, that oh, one. Smart. Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, They're especially just Walmart right now. We had an, a yeah. troll doll. Here we go. Oh, Ooh. come on. Here we go. We're going to troll them on Twitter. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to troll them on Twitter. <laughs> Let's see. What else do we got? Uh, so is that. that Bears counts. looking All through. Right, here we go. That looks black and blue to me. So is that. That counts. All right. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> My birthmark. This is my face. This hey. is my birthmark. That was easy. <laughs> item item yeah, number one seventy. A birthmark. This is my face. I like oh, it. The chat. I should say, you guys. The chat has pointed out to us that Linda Noble lives in Rhode Island, so we should honor. Oh, the that's Rhode right. Island. She does. Yes. Yes. I'll. I'll. I'll tell her right now. I oh, apologize. Oh, we have an entry from you Karma. Here we go. It'll be Sam's Island. favorite. F sharp. F sharp. It's the best. By far. Ah. By far the best. <laughs> Yes, one of the items on the list. One of the items on the list, in fact, is playing in F sharp on a piano. <laughs> that is Believe that it or not, my friends. favorite one. That's gonna get twenty thousand points bonus from me. <laughs> Sam, I'm allowed to do that. that. You can't, Sam. You can't do that. Look, Jude. You had your chance to stop me. You didn't. <laughs> I should have. I should have. I tell you what. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at these ranks again and see how we are okay. doing. Oh, trademark still in the lead. They're still, still in the lead. demolishing. Ha hasn't Man. shifted much. Hasn't shifted much. Fifty. Steve, if you get a chance to to go over back to the Twitter feed, Daily Special has posted item number eighty-two, which is one of them singing a famous song from a famous movie in front of a movie theater. Oh, That's cool. Okay. Oh, yeah, it just came up. Just came up. Let's, famous uh, song from a famous movie in front of a movie theater. Yeah, see if you can find that on the Twitter feed. Find that. Uh, it is our our favorite baritone, Ben Lewin. Oh. 
I'm sorry, Todd. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know what this is, but we got to watch it. All right, here we go. Okay. Um, <laughs> Doodly do the safety dance, KK. It's a uh, safety dance. dance. Doodly do the safety dance, KK. Do the safety dance. Oh, my God. <laughs> do the safety dance while wearing a face mask or protective goggles. Uh, That's incredible. <laughs> Let's see what else we got here. A flip phone. A flip phone. Yes. Ooh, yeah. A flip yes. phone. Very nice. Somebody was able to find one. Okay, That's where where cool. is this daily special one? Oh, it must have been it was earlier. Like, it was no, it was really new. Uh, so like a, it's okay. If we don't find it, we don't find it. But okay, it was just we've been... got. What do we got here? I don't know, but he like recorded guitar. it silently apparently, because there's no sound. <laughs> That's his left hand playing a G major chord. Right? Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, it was item one thirty seven or something. Your left hand strumming a G major chord. I love this. Oh, what is this? I know redhead. <laughs> I know redhead. Item fifty-eight, a wig. I know redhead. I love the loop, by the way, on all of these. Hey, uh, <laughs> I wondered if it might be time for another one of our guest spots. Do we have anybody else calling into the show? Uh, we are supposed to, but they are apparently not here. So uh... okay, all right. Well, too busy scoring points. Yeah, seriously, yeah, trademark is missing their spot. <laughs> they are doing very well, though. So. I guess they've sacrificed, you know, human interaction in favor well, of winning. Tell you what, in place of their spot, why don't we talk about some of the uh, prizes that the winners of this entire show are going to get? I like that. I like Happy that. Happy about Steve. that. Should I take it over? Yeah, dude, go. So uh, one of the prizes that everybody that's going to be winning, uh, well, not every, the quartet that's going to be winning the show, who we shall see. Um, By is the show, a... we don't mean this episode. We mean the entire no, season. You're right. Yeah, not not this episode, yeah. but the entire season of the show. Um, once we reach the very end, the winning quartet will be receiving several things. One of which is um, a custom arrangement by the fabulous Steve Tramac, and um, Steve Tramac has actually done some arrangements that we've done. And perhaps Steve, is there any chance that we actually have a video that we could show? Of we sure do. The video okay. starts a, a couple of measures in, but hopefully you will all uh, recognize it. Here we Love go. It. Destination. On a tour of one night stands, my suitcase and guitar in hand, and every stop is neatly planned for a holy.
Oh, I love that song. Pre-pandemic. Well, the the Ray Mac is a fantastic right arranger. He is. Yes. We can't talk about that for too long, though, because I Keith from Trademark you. has Let called in, and we have audience. him on the line. Here he is. Keith. Oh, very much oh no, I hit the wrong That's button. Oh, Steve. No. Hold on. Wait, I can do it for real. Find him. There he is. There, there he is. is. There there is. is. <laughs> Hey, how's Keith, it going? Well, you? Did you know that your pass, you? did you know that your passcode is uh case sensitive? I sure didn't. Oh, <laughs> oh, no. oh yeah. We won't tell anybody else, don't worry. Yeah. I feel like a nut job. Keith, how are yeah. you? Um is high blood pressure a feeling? <laughs> I, I yeah. Uh, where where yeah. are you, Keith? I'm in my bedroom, and this house, this okay. old house that we're renting, doesn't have good overhead lighting, so we've used Christmas lights or fairy lights if you're overseas. <laughs> nice. Very appropriate. And how you guys doing with finding items? Oh, we're doing great. We're doing awesome. It's, yeah, you guys it's are super dope. Crushing the leaderboard right now. What's well, your we'll secret? Oh, we need a refresh on that, too. Our secret is being a hoarder so that your house is full of unnecessary things. <laughs> <laughs> I recommend it highly. There we go. That'll do it. We'll oh, tell you man. what. Good luck to you. Keep going. We got a, we've got daily special on the line too. We're gonna talk to them real quick. Keep okay, counting it sounds out. great. Love you guys. Bye. All right. See you later. Okay. Now let me see if I can uh, tell you what. What we will take a look at the rank while I am pulling up daily special. Oh oh oh! There's so many good, oh. so many good things on the Twitter feed. Oh, no. Whoa. That's big. Big news. Yikes. That guys. This that. is a, is intense. that intense. That's a Dead tie. tie. That's a tie. Woo-hoo-hoo. Tied for first. Oof. That's because Keith was spending all that time trying to get the password to the Zoom room, right? <laughs> See, that's what kept Ripple yeah. Effect back before. We talked to them earlier. Ripple Effect just called. They want us to put Keith back on the phone again. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Well, uh, I've got Chad here, sort of. Here we go. All right. I found him. All right. Let's check in with hey, Chad everybody. from so... Daily Special. So here's the deal. I just went out to get a photo of a bookstore because there's one near my apartment. It's only one point. But it felt like the most dramatic thing to do while on a Zoom call. <laughs> so yeah, you got to check those point values out. there, buddy. Yeah, well, you know, that's how... You, listen, I'm playing Moneyball out here. You think I'm... <laughs> you, think, you think I'm playing to... I, I don't know, man. Normally, I'm, I'm trying to be as, like, you know witty as possible but i'm walking faster than i've walked since march 13th and it's <laughs> really weighing on me um i don't know you walked pretty fast with that egg and spoon actually i walked like slightly below average with the egg and spoon um <laughs> isaac and ben walked fast with the egg and spoon but you know you might have to check the tapes on that one that was controversial for sure hey. I, I love, go ahead. No, it's you, Todd. What do you got? I I, I don't know. <laughs> so what's your, what's your strategy? How are you doing this? What's your approach? So here's the thing. We have a Trello board. Do you guys know what that is? No. So Trello is like an organization sort of productivity app. And we copied all the spreadsheet cells into Trello cards, which can easily oh. be moved from one column to another. So we've assigned everything to different people based on what we can do. Meanwhile, Ben is at home, like Wade and Kim Possible, uh, posting everything to Twitter so that the other three of us are not slowed down. Or are you just sending him all the pictures you take? That's the idea. He's kind of swamped right now, though, because I don't think we anticipated, um, like, you know, load time for videos and stuff like that. Mm. Ah, It's the whole thing. Gotcha. Meanwhile, it's I just got a notification though. that Isaac sent me a photo of a birthmark, and I know it says it's supposed to be appropriate for the internet, but I do not trust <laughs> him on that. So <laughs> I'm, a, I'm afraid to check my notifications. Okay. Oh well, tell you what, we're going to go find that now. All right, good luck finding the rest of your items, man. Bring up the Hi, Chad. Yeah, we will need it. Hi, Chad. Hi, Chad. Bye, Chad. bye guys. Bye, Chad. Hey, Chad. <laughs> bye. Oh, my okay. God. I feel like I feel like we, I wish we could just sit here and read the list of things to the audience. Can like, we give them some flavor? Like give them a few. Them a, let's let's give them a few. Okay, here we go. go like I've already said my right. my one that I put in there. I'll do the safety dance while wearing safety yeah. equipment. 
for example, one, a pine cone, two, a portable toilet, we're off to a great start. Three, a diploma or certificate. And you, you know, this just goes, uh, what is number 12? Fear. Can anyone <laughs> describe fear to me? Anyway, a rock, a cat, a birdhouse, a worm, comma, but not gummy. This is, <laughs> this is fantastic. I mean, I, I can't believe, and Chad, with the, with the specific note about, it being a safe birthmark i just it shows how how much they really care guys okay. they had no how much time how much time do you think they invested in setting up that trello board and you know doling out the, i mean instead of Too just much. going i don't know but you guys got to see what isaac's doing here check this out oh no oh no oh yes oh yes <laughs> there we oh, go no. there's his cardboard cutout oh man <laughs> cardboard cutout that's two maybe now this, this would be the statue of David. He is very old monument. You know what else he is? <laughs> Cardboard cutout. That's two, maybe. Oh, Let's see, we've also got oh, candles. God. We've got one member sitting in a swing. Nice. Okay, so the audience, the audience can go follow this live on Twitter. Oh too, yes, right? absolutely. Go, There's the G chord again. That hashtag is right at the bottom of the screen. You can go follow it yourself and see all because we are only showing you a tiny percentage of the items here. Oh yeah, it's way more fun to go watch it yourself. Oh, absolutely, it is. We've got. Uh, let's see, what else are some good ones? What is this? Your reflection in something other than a mirror. Oh, oh nice. nice. Look, there I am. Woo! There you go. I like if that. You look closely, you can see Nick's. <laughs> oh, we've got something from. There is a taxi behind us on the yellow. Oh, yeah. Yep. We see. All right, it. I would here say we a are. Hot second has an advantage. <laughs> there is a taxi behind us on the yellow. Oh, yeah. Whoops. Oh no. What are All right. We... Here oh, we, we are. are. Oh, I broke it. Oh. oh we're there back. is a taxi behind us on the yellow. <laughs> okay. Yeah. The taxi. Keep All right. Here we are. Goodness. Stop it. It's still going. There we go. Okay, I fixed it. Well, speaking of uh, of Nick, we have him on the line here as soon as he, uh, as soon as he timed. makes his way in. Uh, his video is muted and his sound is muted. So uh, hopefully he will join us shortly here. While while we are waiting, though, let's yep. check out the Check current. the leaderboard. Yeah, let's check the leaderboard. Oh, wow. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. Ripple effect has jumped out to a tremendous lead. Look is that the, that just the Canadian exchange rate kicking in? <laughs> wow. Okay. Provincial point tax. I know, right? I wonder. Oh, goodness. We will have to check the spreadsheet later and see what they did to get all of that. That is Ooh, crazy. Indeed. That's a whole bunch of five pointers right, all right there. Come on, Nick. What's going on? We have him on the hook here, but he is not not showing up. Maybe if I ask him to start his video. I don't know. It is not working. Okay, Nick tell you Steve what. Bird. I am just going to make remove him and make him call back in. <gasps> okay, hopefully he will. But we also have... I'll try to text him. We have... Uh, um, who do we have? We have Dan from... Uh, I don't know who we have. We'll find out in a moment. I think this is Dan from Full of It. I think Let's he's a little out. bit early. We'll see if he pops in here. Here we go. There he is. All right, let's get Are we here? on the screen. Oh, we have people we will who be think in just that. a moment. There he is. We hey, found him. Hey, Dan. Oh, we found somebody. It's Dan and Val. Dan and Val. Hey, guys. Hey, how's it this going is with your hunt? By the way. <laughs> We're finding everything and having a hard time tweeting about it. Yeah, fair. <laughs> There. Gotcha. gotcha. So what's what's the strategy for you guys? Uh, the strategy is half and half. We thought we'd send uh, Bear and Jasmine to Walmart and be awesome. That's our strategy. And then um, Val and I are staying at the house and doing shots. <laughs> <laughs> Does seem like a winning strategy. Can't. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> hard yeah, to argue exactly, with that right? one. Like, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Right. We'll tell you what we will. We don't want to distract you from that important work, so we'll let you get back to it. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Good luck with the judging. Good, good, good luck. Guys. We'll see right. you guys later. Yeah. What are you guys doing right now? We're we're just live streaming right. the show. 
<laughs> See you later. <laughs> Look, on our show. I mean, we're sitting comfortably in our own homes. Yeah, I mean, not not in, 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 in the weather room. and stuff. And uh, I still hear Val. Oh, I do. Hi, Val. Steve. Not anymore. Nope. Um, all right. So, so it's funny. She says, "What are we doing?" Because really, for all intents and purposes, what we're doing is pretty easy compared to what they're doing. Uh, yeah. Just in case anybody's just tuning in now, believe it or not, we have barbershop quartets all over the world who are racing around with a list of two hundred items uh, in a in an enormous socially distanced scavenger hunt that have to tweet. Uh, evidence of the finds of these scavenger hunts. They are doing the hard work, but also doing the hard work are our three volunteers behind yeah. the scenes who are taking the live stream from Twitter and putting it into the tally and creating the score sheet that Steve will show you in just a minute. Those three volunteers are, are friends of ours. Their names are Xander Williams, Linda Noble, and Victoria White, also known as Sunshine the Dog. If you're not sure why that's a thing, talk to Victoria sometime. <laughs> it's a thing. Well, on that note, speaking of which, this whole contest, we looked at one of our prizes earlier, Jude. Want to take a look yeah. at another one? Absolutely. I would. You want to tell people what it is or <laughs> let well, me stand yeah, here I awkwardly? Would, I would. No, I, would, I forgot that I was going to be the one that was saying about it. So, the, um, of course, we had the prize, which is an arrangement by Steve Tramac. Uh, the other big prize for this entire competition is custom learning tracks made by the fabulous Drew Wheaton, who has a long history as an excellent barber shopper, but also as an excellent learning track maker. Um, and perhaps we had an example of those. We sure do. Steve. Here's something Drew just posted recently. And I die, I want a yellow coffin when I, when I Man, and we feel really lucky. We, yeah, we feel so lucky that we have like these these sponsors that are sponsoring our show. This is fantastic. I know I mean, for this and, silly shenanigans, there's like real people yeah. coming out of the woodwork. I like it. Yeah. Well, wow. let's want to see how we're doing on the leaderboard. Absolutely. I think we need to see. Here we go. Oh, ripple effect still. Trademark Ooh. coming up. Trademark though. is in second now. I still think this is close. I do honestly. I still think we could see somebody come up from that's not on that top three right now and just steal it away. Yeah. Well, we we uh, are going to get to check in with Taylor Made here in a moment. We've got Steve Kirsch on the line. As soon as he uh, gets his video connected, we will get to see how he is Fantastic. doing. Let's uh, let's bring him on right now. Here he is. Hey, buddy, how's it going? Hey, Steve. All right, I am muted. I am now unmuted. Okay, I'm doing great. <laughs> Steve, I just saw a fabulous picture of you on the internet holding an egg. <laughs> it's right on my phone here, too. <laughs> uh, so, so hi, guys. Today, tonight, I am flying solo as the other what? three. What? Other three what? Have, yeah, crazy work commitments. Well, everybody knows that Rick Taylor works full time. Um, yeah, you know, for Harmony Foundation, he's always on the phone. So, and oh, both I'm sure Doug, both Tom and Doug are uh, committed as well. So, uh, I am doing my best here. I am uh, wow, and I've actually stayed in the house and have a decent list. So, I'm kind of happy with that. <laughs> Incredible. There you go, yeah. fantastic. Yeah, the, the wear, wearing the Avengers shirt tonight. Nice. Yes. Oh, love it. Yeah. That was one of the items, wasn't it? It was one of the so, items, absolutely. Well, tell um, you what, we. Definitely want to don't don't want to take up your time if you're flying solo on this. No, that's fine. I, and you know, real quick, guys, I want to thank you for uh, such kind words. First off, for putting this whole thing together, uh, and second, uh, what you guys said after our performance, our video from last week with the uh, barbershop stuff. I just truly appreciate you know all the love from everybody. Uh, we we love you know we love our hobby. Uh, we enjoy singing uh, you know, oftentimes very square music. Uh, but it, we just love ringing those chords and uh, performing yeah. the best we can. So, so much, so much thanks to you for uh, sharing that love. Appreciate it. Uh, it's only because we the, have the you pleasure is ours. 
yeah, yeah seriously. Thank you, thank you, we're the, we're thank the ones who got to listen to it, man. Yeah. <laughs> we got to sit back and listen. Thanks. Yeah. All right, man. We'll go find some more items. Good luck. Okay. Yeah. I'm, Thanks, and, Steve. And, and, uh, my first day on Twitter too. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> See you later, Bye, Steve. Okay. Take care, guys. Thanks very much. <laughs> oh man, that's uh, well. That's fantastic. We should. <laughs> let's go to the host. The host Bill. might work. <laughs> I'm just saying, like Bill, Bill's uh, Bill's comment in the chat: Steve yep. sucking up to the hosts won't help. It might. <laughs> I, We've I, never I, seen any proof. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, uh, honestly, this one we're 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 not not judging or anything. This no, is uh, twenty thousand points around like it's candy. But, the it's people you want to bribe are actually the folks taking this off the Twitter feed and putting it in the tally, the Linda and Xander and, and Victoria. All right. Well, we got some Twitter feed to catch up with here. Let's take oh, let's a look it. at, oh, please. Yes. Let's take a look at bear on a tricycle. <laughs> no. He's going to get kicked out. He's willing to get kicked out. <laughs> oh God. I hope if he does, I hope they post it on Twitter. Is that on our list? Getting kicked out of Walmart? Getting kicked out of Walmart. Get out of here! I could be in the next round. Oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> the <scene. laughs> nice. There we go. Oh, hey, hey there's one of Steve's me. Legos. He's nice. got Legos. What is this? Board games. That's a lot of board games. So I got some board <laughs> games for you. That's a lot of board games. So I got Stop. some. That's a lot of board games. Okay, let's. We missed a lot. Let's scan back here. What else we got? Uh, stranger matching pitch. Oh. Uh, yeah. There you go. Oh, Just enough. Nailed it. I like it. You nailed it. I just died. The barber shopper in the making, right there. F on the grand piano. Oh, it's just a picture. Is that not a video? It's not you a video. You have to find it yourself. Hold on, you have to find it yourself. It's right it's, it's right between the okay. Oh, the taxi we already saw. I want to see this one with uh with the songs, but I can't find them. There's I so know. many things. My goodness. This uh That's the two for one this, right there. This Twitter feed. Holy cow. What is what is that? That's a like a, left foot. That's a, so, a toe sock. A left. It is definitively a left sock. <laughs> left sock. <laughs> well I done. Because of the toes. The toes. Guys, I can't believe they're all doing this. It's insane. This is so great. <laughs> okay. You know, can, can we stop looking at his left foot? <laughs> right. right. <laughs> yes. Yes, we can. In fact, Indeed. we uh, we have uh, Gabriel <laughs> from Hot Second. Uh, in the waiting room here. Let's see if he can come on. We can get an update from Hot um, Second. Hi. Here go. And Hello. here he is. Yay. Oh, they're sacrificing two for this. Oh. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm in the process of filling one out right now. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. How are you doing? Good. Well, you'll, how are you doing? Uh, uh, tremendously stressed. Uh, we sent Nick and Baz out onto the street, and they accidentally drove into the middle of a protest at the Barclays Center. Oh, okay. oh, oh no. New York. Yep. So they are uh, having difficulty. Oh, getting that's going to slow them down. Oh, no. Yeah, oh, no. I think they did finally manage to park and go into a Target or something. I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, Teamwork. Uh, but, so, so what was the strategy for you guys? How how do you approach this? Uh, so Eric and I have stayed at home and have been upending everything, uh, tearing <laughs> apart our down sofa to get something with feathers, um, and like sprinting up and down the stairs. And we're gonna go outside in like a minute to get one last five pointer. Um, but go. Nick and Baz went out onto the street in a in theory to like find people and find locations that are not our home, and then got stuck. Cool. Oh uh, no! That's been the goal. Yeah. <laughs> dang. Oh dang. Okay. Yeah. Well, well, Gabriel, we, we, I saw your video of the dulcimer. That was really cool. Yeah, playing it with my phone. I still got it right here. Nice. <laughs> well, you've only got three <laughs> minutes left, go. so you gotta you gotta get to it. We'll let you go do. We've got go, one go, more quartet to catch up with. See right. you guys later. Bye, Gabriel. <laughs> hey, and they like are watching their time, right? Because otherwise, they're just gonna keep going forever. I hope so. We're going to stop counting at 8.45, either way. Yeah. Um, now, that said, we've got one more quartet to hear from. We've got hey. Karma here. So, Karma, how are you guys doing? How what What's your strategy? Can you see me? Yes. A little bit. Yeah. Yes, I can. So, the strategy is 
since my wife is pregnant, like at the very end of it, she is uh, like uh, the uh, in a communication center trying to coordinate everybody else on the road. I'm the only one driving at the moment, so I'm I'm the one supposed to get the items far away, like I'm <laughs> like I'm to do about right now, um, and. Man, we tried to have a strategy at the beginning, but everybody was like, <laughs> just looking at the list, like all the time. I'll do this, I'll do that, and then, yeah, it just went, in, it it went boom, uh, it went crazy. So everybody's <laughs> crazy. As you can see on our page, we did uh, we did things similar like several times, um, <laughs> but now I I just I. Just the heck, yeah. I gotta get out. Just, just a minute. I'll take you with me. <laughs> no, that's oh, okay. No. You go do oh, your no. thing. You finish it up. Thanks for calling in. We'll see you guys later. Okay. All bye. Right, bye. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh Ooh. man, they've only got a minute <laughs> left. I'm stressed for them. Holy oh, cow. Okay, do we want to take one last look at the Twitter feed? The last look we we're going to give, right? Okay, or no? So we, uh, we have one more leaderboard. We're not going to show, we're not going to show the leaderboard, right? No more Correct. leaderboard. Okay. Correct. All right, here we go. No. We've got, oh, uh, okay. Yeah, this is cheesy enough that I have to show it. Here we go. We've got something that makes you truly happy. This is my uh, wonderful wife. Uh, of course. Uh, of course. Of course. <laughs> so you need something that makes you happy? This is my wonderful wife. She makes me very happy. Oh. Hi, April. <laughs> see, we got a diploma. Can't hear we you got... Twitter. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Did he get his feathers? Hello. This is a teeny. Oh, come on, focus. <laughs> Look at it. Look at that little feather. It counts. Wait, there's more. <laughs> From the Brooklyn <laughs> couch. We got <laughs> Oh, what, what is, is going happening? on there? Blonde hair. Oh, blonde hair. Got it. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Nice job, Taylor made. Here we go. Oh, facey. Something that's not a face. It's got a kind of a, like a facial face. thing going it's on here. Okay. 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 All right. That'll work. Yeah. I like that. Medusa-esque. Okay. Let's see. What? Else? Oh, a song. This is a G major. If this guitar was in tune, but who knows if it is? Not me. <laughs> 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 Oh, we've got masks. Oh, oh, here we go. Another store item. Here we Let got. me be your loving teddy bear. <laughs> what item is that? What, is, what are we watching? Item 177, a microphone. Let me be okay. your okay. loving teddy bear. <laughs> oh, the chat, there's okay. Chad in his bookstore. There's a, book, there's a bookstore. It's very quiet. Oh, it's yeah, we can't hear him. It's just a video of a book, bookstore. Chad, okay. it's nice to hear from you. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, item 174, Duck, Duck, Goose. <laughs> Hold on, we got to start from the beginning. Tell me they worked that out ahead of time. Goose! There she goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what have we done? What have we done? Nice fun, Jeff. Oh, okay. what does Karma have? Okay. Do hey, you have life. any fun putting together a compilation of some of the best ones oh, from this? We are absolutely going to be putting. Oh yeah, we, we, we need a compilation. There will be. M O U S E. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Cool. 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 Ah, oh, there's some cool heartfelt ones going on here too. This is nice. <laughs> Okay, yeah, well, we were able to actually play along to time hey. is up. Oh, wow. Time is up. We are going to give our our awesome volunteers a couple of minutes to uh, finalize any of the uh, the scores that they have to put in. And then we oh, are going to come back to and we are going to have a winner for you. Hey, but, can I talk about the thing for next week? The, the, the sponsorship? Yes, please. Cool. So um, by a miracle of the highest order uh this group of four people that you see on the screen has received another sponsorship oh here's my cat everyone say hello to theodore hi cat he was on the live stream now he was on the live stream don't scratch the chair come on um anyway so we're 
yeah, uh, we received another sponsorship. It is, oh my gosh, I'm excited about this. Bread and Spoon. Bread mm. and Spoon is a bakery in the New York City and New Jersey area. And they are sponsoring our next episode, episode five. So we can announce now that Bread and Spoon will be giving away a prize package to the winner of the next episode, episode number five. So you're going to have to tune in to see who will win that and also maybe see more of Theo because he's really cute. That's all. That's all I wanted to say. Thanks. <laughs> no. I'll, I'll tell you what. Lost, uh, we, have, oh, no. we have a little bit of a special treat tonight. So as Ooh. some of you, while we are waiting for the scores to be tabulated, uh, as some of you may know, I ran an event this past spring called Verbicon, Virtual Barbershop mm -hmm. Contest. Uh, it was just for the quartets in the Northeast, and I was trying to run a second one, a Verbicon 2.0 in the fall that was going to be open to the whole world. Well, apparently... The idea from the first one caught on, and everybody else started doing stuff like it. Uh, and now there are festivals and contests all over that everybody else is running. And so Verbicon 2.0 did not get enough submissions to run. So I had to cancel it. However, we did Thanks. get some submissions, and some of them are really, really cool. And I talked to the people who submitted them, and they said that they would be cool with us premiering their amazing creations on our uh, on our show here. So first, we have you've probably if you've ever been on Facebook on the Barbershop Harmony Society uh, page, you've probably seen some of their videos. We have a song from Luke and M down in uh, down under. Here we go. Check this out. One, two, three. Uh, ah, 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 ah. The fisherman fishes the baker man makes to the bells of Notre Dame. To the big bells as loud as a thunder. The little bell soft as a summer song. And some say the soul of the cities, that's all of the bells. The bells. Listen, they are beautiful, but they don't ring by themselves, no. High in the tower is the bell ringer. Why is he there? It's the tale of a man and a monster. Judge can't fall along to purge the world of vice and sea. But he felt fear for his soul and took in this young child deformed from birth, calling him Quasimodo. Dies irae, dies irae. I must keep him locked away where no one else can see. No one who behold him. Even this foul creature yet might prove one day to be. Guess if you can sing the bells of Notre Dame. Who is a monster and who is a man? Safe behind those windows and these parapets of stone. Gazing at the people down below me. And all my life I watch them as I hide up here alone. Hungry for the histories they show me And all my life I memorize their faces Just knowing them as they will never know me And I wonder all my life I wonder how it feels to pass the day Not above them But part of them Sun, give me 
one day out there. All I ask is one to hold forever out there, where they all live on. What I give, what I give, what I dare, I dare just to live. They shout and scold and go about their lives. Needless of the gift it is to be them. If I was in this skin, I treasure every instant of their strolling by the sand. A taste of morning out there, like ordinary men who freely walk about. Just one day and then I swear I'll be content with my share, with my share. Won't resent, won't despair, old and bent. I won't care, I'll have spent one day. If you can sing the bells of Notre Dame Who is a monster and who is a man See the bells, 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 bells Bells of Notre Dame just two people that's that's incredible that's fantastic congrats steve, luke and I, m that's fantastic we, steve we have to wish that you know that verbicon 2 could have happened but we selfishly are glad that you are directing your attention towards barbershop <laughs> <laughs> indeed <laughs> um but perhaps one day in the future and for now we have some cool content so um before we go before we announce our winners for this evening uh, we have to once again thank all of our sponsors. Uh, I forgot to mention before our previous sponsor is Sweetie Bee Bakes, um, who makes awesome granola and has sent a prize package to Ripple Effect because they won last week. Uh, our sponsor for next week, which is Bread and Spoon, which we are super excited to talk more about next week. And of course, our overall sponsors, Drew Wheaton, who makes awesome learning tracks, and Steve Tramack, who makes awesome charts. Please go check all of them out. Go find them on Facebook and go like them. Um, please find our YouTube channel and like us. Please go find all these fantastic quartets that you're watching do these ridiculous activities and go like their pages. They deserve it. Um, we could not do this without them. Seriously. Absolutely. And it's actually giving us an opportunity to have our quartets that are competing uh, give back as well through a Fundly campaign. So we'll be posting all of their charity Fundly campaigns up onto our Facebook and website this week or it's coming up soon. So you can be feel free to go to our website or our Facebook to see all of the different charities that are being represented by our different quartets and support them there. Before we announce the winners, I want to make sure that we have the opportunity to thank the the behind the scenes volunteers one more time for doing all of that tallying and keeping up with the Twitter feed. So Victoria, Linda, and Xander, thank you so so much for volunteering to do thank that. You all. Sad not to yeah, have you in the you. chat, but uh, but boy, what, there. what what a way to be to be our friends, and we're we're so appreciative. Uh, and you, finally, to say thank you to the incredible quartets. I cannot wait to go watch the rest of that Twitter feed and see all the nonsense out there. Uh, if, if ever there was a, a friend of mine said after watching the, the Egg and Spoon race, they said, you know, I wasn't sure how the non-singing thing was going to be. But boy, what a way to showcase the entertainment value that that these that these talented yeah. people bring. And, and that showed through tonight, too. 
what a collection of personalities, what a, a collection of just fun-loving, good-hearted people uh, from top to bottom. And with that said, the winner of tonight's episode with 143 points is... Full of it! Hey! <laughs> nice job! Nice job, nice job guys. guys. Full of it. Nothing so, like nothing like spending 45 minutes at a Walmart to really rack up those points. I know, right? So Full of It <laughs> has won immunity for next week, so they can't get eliminated nice. next week. Congratulations on that, Full of It. Although, you should still submit your video, and don't leave us hanging on that. Speaking of which, next week, I say next week, it's not really next week, it's two weeks from now. Uh, our next episode is on October 7th. It is going to be episode 5. It is called In Your Own Words. The theme of this episode is going to be parody writing. All of our quartets have been preparing parodies, but not just any parodies about anything. We gave them some very specific guidelines they have to follow. There is an object that they have to include in their video, and a a, a word or phrase that they have to include as well. So we are going to get to all of us, uh, us and you guys and us included, watch how these quartets manage to creatively work these uh, admittedly uh, odd and difficult to work in objects and words that we required them to work in. It's going to be a, a fun exercise in how creative and fun and awesome they can be. And I cannot wait because, boy, are they creative and fun and awesome. Um, our quartet that uh, lost today. We need to. We want to make sure we give them a fair shake. So we are going to double check the feed and double check all the scores and make sure everything is uh, super solid before we announce them. So we will be announcing them on the beginning of our next episode. So make sure that you tune in two weeks from tonight, eight o'clock for Barbershop Royale episode four. And uh, Todd's got something to say. Go ahead. Yeah. If uh, to all of our fans who are watching this either live and we love our live feed people and anybody watching this after the fact, if you're enjoying what you're seeing, we're enjoying making this and providing this this resource. And I know the quartets that are participating are enjoying this. Please share the Facebook event for episode five. Once it comes out, spread it out to everybody. We really want to share this yeah. fun and nonsense with as many people as possible, uh, especially while we're, we're just missing so many opportunities to see the talent that these quartets are bringing. So share it out there. Don't just look at it, but share it, give it to all sorts of people. Indeed. Thank you all so much for being here tonight. Thank you to the quartets. Thank you to Thank the volunteers. You Thank you to the sponsors. We are having so much fun with this, and we can't wait to see you in a couple of weeks. We are going to leave you out with, in case any of you managed to miss that amazing Steve Tramack chart earlier, because our viewer count is much higher now than it was then. We're going to give you one more shot at it. Thank you so much, and we'll see you in a couple of weeks. Thanks, everybody. Good night. Stands my suitcase and guitar in hand, and every stop is neatly planned for a holy and a one man band. Homeward bound, I wish I was homeward bound.
to confess. 